and it's been more than three weeks since the Andover tornado touched down, destroying many buildings and homes in its path. Yeah, and since that day, it's been a team effort as volunteers, crews, and city workers work to clean up the devastation. KSN's Jessica Watson in Andover tonight with details. Carpets, walls, mattresses, and more. It's all that remains for some homeowners in Andover. Public Works employees taking what remains to the landfill. I know the residents have had a ton of work on their end. There's been a lot of volunteers. Over on the Cedric County side of the damage, Cedric County Public Works has had 10 dumpsters in the neighborhoods impacted. And Monday also marks the last day of cleanup. I think we've got all the tree waste out that's a arrived again over the weekend. We had some more stuff that got pushed out to the right of way. Uh, they've been working all day to get that stuff hauled out. Jim Weber, the Cedric County Public Works Director, says the volunteer efforts has helped speed up cleanup at a crucial time. Happy to be getting out of it. I mean, we got plenty to do. We're, we're down. Our workforce in the field is at 66% because of the labor problems. While this process, the cleanup is ending, the Andover Public Works Director says they will continue to lend a hand to those impacted when they can. It gives them some sense that they feel like they can get to a point where they can start and start their recovery phase and start building back their lives. And the Andover director of the Public Works Department says if you do still have some debris left over on your curb, do not worry. They're going to make sure to clean up all the stuff that was left out today. Here for you, Jessica Watson, KSN News 3.